And here is our first final of the day, believe it or not. It's in our Vincennes University High School class. It's Caleb Morrison. He gets a solo shot at the uh, finals today. Brandon Craze uh, broke that Dodge truck. So that'll put uh, Caleb Morrison as our winner today in Vincennes University High School class. If you've got a high schooler with a car and they want to come and play with it safely, this is the place to do it. I want to thank Vincennes University for their sponsorship of the high school class. Caleb is from Washington High School, just south up the uh, road here. He puts a, a 1018 on that Black Pontiac Grand Am. Puts the wheels in the lights. Good leave for the Pontiac. Crosses the stripe with a 1069 at a 67 miles an hour for the win. Congratulations, Kayla Morrison, our winner in the Vincennes University High School class. Country in lane with a 790 on the American RV dial in board, racing for White's Purple. That is Mara White. That's going to be a big test for Mara if she can wait out the other dragster, as there is a, a big difference between the 790 on Mara's dragster and the 1290 on Allie's dragster. Mara, no stranger to the junior dragster ranks. Here we go as both drivers begin to pre-stage. Allie first in on the stage, followed by Mara, and here we go. Good launch for Allie Phillips. Now the countdown. Another good launch for Mara. A little better than Allie. Will it be enough for the win this time? Your win line goes to great run for Mara White, runs a 791 at 82 miles an hour. Winner in today's Hoosier Insurance Junior Dragster. All right, our next final is on two wheels, motorcycle final for our first Saturday of racing. We put busy Bill McCarty on two wheels and we put him in the Stoles Country in lane. He's sponsored by Andy's Collision Repair in Terre Haute, 1981 Honda Matic, and he puts a 1054 on the American RV dial in board. Jeremy Wilcox burning out right now in the 80s collision repair lane. He puts a 650 on the board, so about a four second difference between these two motorcycles. We'll see if Jeremy has the patience to wait that four seconds out. And then try and run down Bill on the big end. And here we go. Both bikes into pre-stage. Bill stages. Jeremy stages. And here we go. Four seconds will seem like an eternity as you sit and wait. And Jeremy's going to have a uh, tough race. Winner, Bill McCarty, runs a 10 at 67 on a 1054 dial at 62 miles an hour. Congratulations, Bill McCarty, winner of the Weston's Lawn Equipment Motorcycle Class. And our next final on this Saturday night is our Lucas Oil Sportsman. I think I'll pick the red car this time. How about you? <laughs> We've got Bill McCarty. He's in the uh, Pontiac, and he is in the Andes Collision Repair Lane. He's got a 958 on that Pontiac. Comes to us out of Spencer, Indiana. Sponsored by Andy's Collision Repair. Cody Stouts is in the Stoles Country in lane. Out of Mooresville, Indiana. Four-cylinder in that uh, Cobalt 2007 with a 1063 on the American RV dial in board. Both drivers pre-stage. Cody Stout first to stage. And here we go. Rare red light from Bill McCarty. That will give the win to Cody Stouts. Cody drives it out, and he will win with a 10.60 at 67 miles an hour. Congratulations to Cody Stouts. 
out of Mooresville, Indiana. He was the Lucas Oil Sportsman on this Saturday night at Lions Raceway Park. And our next final of the evening is the Bowler Performance Transmissions Pro. It all comes down to two drivers. It's Mike Faff in the Faff Farms R&S Lawn Care 1982 Trans Am. He puts a 680 on the American RV dial-in board. Or it's going to be John Hirsch. He's in the industrial recycling. 86 Monte Carlo coming to us out of Elizabethtown, Indiana. Very close. He's got a 697 of the American RV dial -in board. had a great run all day and gets just a little over anxious. Red lights out of the Stoles Country in lane and that gives the wind light to John Hirsch. He runs a seven flat with a four at 98 miles an hour on a 697 dial. Our winner tonight of Bowler Performance Transmissions Pro, John Hirsch out of Elizabethtown, Indiana. Here at Lions Raceway Park, it is Auto Clinic Super Pro in your soul's country in lane out of Dale, Indiana, the Mickey Motorsports Nova, piloted by Daniel Mickey. He puts a 595 on the American Army Repair Lane, sponsored by Pete's Economy Muffler, Motorsports Unlimited, York Racing, and Indy Exhaust Products. With a 604 on the American RV dial-in board, that is Jake Hodge. Drivers in the pre stage. Daniel Mickey quickly into stage, and here we go. Red light. Daniel Mickey, that gives the wind light to Jake Hodge. He drives it through. Winning time of 644 at 82 miles an hour. Congratulations to Jake Hodge from Spencer, Indiana, in the Hook and Hillbilly Vega Wagon. Our winner tonight in Auto Clinic Super Pro.